Hello everyone, I'm Andrew, and this is the FPS General Esports Report. Shoot Mania isn't even out yet, and it already has over 20,000 different levels. In an interview with VentureBeat, Senior Director of Online Strategy Josh Milligan says that a vast majority of those levels are community-made, and that Natio has only produced a small number of maps themselves. Shoot Mania has over 15 different game modes, with user-created game modes thanks to the scripting engine that is part of the game. Natio is really pushing Shoot Mania to become an esports type of game. It's taking off in Europe, but it's having a hard time here in the States. You can join the beta for $16 right now by heading to ShootMania.com. You can read the entire interview by following the link in the description below. Major League Gaming co-founder Sundance DiGiovanni recently sat down with Forbes to talk about Major League Gaming and how it keeps getting bigger. This past spring, MLG set a new record for concurrent viewers of their spring championship broadcast, with over 437,000 viewers tuned in to watch that event and over 4.7 million unique visitors over the championship weekend. When asked about what games they might be adding to MLG's roster, Sundance said he's looking at Shoot Mania, Call of Duty Black Ops 2, Halo 4, and even Planetside 2. You can read the entire interview by following the link in the description below. Red 5's Firefall is back in the news again. This time they are dedicating $1 million prize money for Firefall tournaments next year. The money will support Firefall's mobile gaming unit, a 48-foot-long touring truck that will bring competitive events to many locations across the U.S. They will also be hosting major events like the ESL tournament that they just had at Gamescom. Red5 has also announced that their cash shop should be open at the end of the month, or at least they are hoping it will be. They promise they won't, quote, sell you power, so presumably it'll be cosmetic items only. And that concludes the eSports report. If you liked the video, hit the like button below. For more shooter news, check out our website, fpsgeneral.com, and follow us on Twitter and Facebook. You can check out some of our other videos by visiting our channel and clicking the subscribe button above. And as always, thanks for watching.